wishes, a wheel of fortune. Self-worth equal net worth. So it's like everything that you know that you're worth, baby, you getting it. You're about to get it. This <laughs> thing. Woo! Made me want to get up and dance, honey. I'm about to record this video and just do me the whole little praise dance because y'all just do not even know. I have been struggling to recognize my needs, my wants, and my self-worth. And this is something that I wrote down the other day. We don't have a five here, so I can't even. If you happen to see something behind me, don't be alarmed. That's just goodness and mercy following me all the days of my life. Now you've learned through tests and trials. Put the past behind you. I was just talking about alcohol. That brings spirits in. Spiritual awakening, kundalini arising. Kundalini awakening, I'm sorry. If you the head coach, know what motherfucking position to play, goddammit. <laughs> know what your position is so you can play that shit. Mm. Money make these hoes not keep their hands to themselves. So make sure if you if you have been, you know, however that that you know, may resonate with you in your life. I don't know. Um, that's just something else I seen. Let me see. Let's get back on track. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Coming in fast. Shed old skin. What I say, shedding their fruits. Unlearn finding comfort in chaos. It's okay to not be okay. Um, let me see, let me see, let me see. 23, protect your energy. Make, like I said, make sure that you stay grounded. Um, 888, hands itching. If life throw lemons, then make lemonade. Making something out of nothing is my gift. Highly favored. Like y'all, it's so fucking much in this book. And I really don't even want to just hold y'all up here like this. Good money, eternal love. Like, the ending to all the bullshit. <sighs> the ending to all the bullshit. I, I think I done skipped over, like, the part that I may have needed. But it's just, <laughs> just so overwhelmed and so excited. I'm just so ready. So ready. So ready. So ready. <sighs> so ready. Okay, so warning to some tarot readers that's um, speaking bad on your name or some somebody that's... Okay, so this may be just specifically for me. You know, there could be, like I said, people that's trying to block and do shit, you know, hit them pockets, transmute their energy, baby. It's just that simple. Oh, look, like I said, clean and sober. Alcohol, someone could have an opiate addiction that they're overcoming. Like I said, I'm not sure exactly what this is. So, like, if you had someone, two, two, I don't have another two out here, but that doesn't mean anything. Still, if, like, your life has been 
feeling imbalanced. Like if you've had other people, like if you're a tarot reader as well, and you've got other tarot readers that's talking shit about you, you know, that's just even more of a confirmation. Just hit the motherfuckers in the pocket, point blank, period. I was listening to one audio and they was like, you know what? This is how we, you know, hit the hit the government, hit these big wigs, hit they fucking pockets to where they don't have the power. Look, they're materialistic and greedy. Hit them in their fucking pockets. Be greedy about your goddamn energy. They want to take it, then, hey, let me get paid. Let me get that. Let me transmute that energy, that negativity that they send it. Let me get paid every time. Let me heal every time. All right, spirit, may I have more clarity on this oak tree? Ooh. Emptiness. Detach from whatever emptiness you may feel. Again, grow. Look, recovering. The fear from being hurt, recovering because you're about to have eternal love. You got eternal love. Fear could be blocking you. Or that's maybe what have been blocking you. But now I feel like you're recovering from that. Like I said, being empty, not knowing who you are, what your worth is. That's a dishonor to yourself. That shit was a dishonor to yourself. So I feel like now we're waking it up. Yeah, we're no longer feeling weak, like actually waking up to really understand like, okay, I feel weak. Let me go and ground myself then, God damn it, because I'm this oak tree, this ancestral wisdom. Look, celebration. Now it's time to celebrate. For every loss that you took, it's time to celebrate. Anything regarding, look, spiritual growth, it's time for a comeback for all of that. Give me that back. Let me get that back. What size is this going to be for, Spirit? There's a masculine that's having a renewed determination to possibly, I don't know if this is a masculine that's on opioids. Open. I don't know. I don't even fucking know. Yeah, I don't know how opiates, opioids. I don't from some fucking addiction. Okay, I I don't know about all that shit. Um, I'm the herb lady. We we go straight for the herbs. I ain't know about all that bullshit. I don't know about the drugs and all that other shit that people can be. You know manipulated through but i hope that anyone that is battling any addictions regardless if it is drugs alcohol love because love is damn near like a drug you get to feeling for it love and just do any and everything so hey you feel me um yeah look spiritual growth from that from feeling empty that's so fucking amazing y'all thank you spirit thank you thank you thank you yeah. Look at this. Simplify your life. Eliminate clutter from your home and your work life to balance the flow of things. Do you see how she is outside? Divine magic. Look. You are being helped. Heaven is working behind the scene to help you, even if you don't see the results yet. Even if you aren't paying attention to the to the signs that they are giving you. Even if you don't notice it. Start being more present, and I bet you you're going to fucking notice it. Simplify your life. Clarity, please. Just throw away anything. Clean up. Like, I literally today got up and just started cleaning up. It was like all of my energy had been, like, returned or something. Look, self-employed. That business gonna pop. You were a born entrepreneur. 
consult an expert because you've been praying to your ancestors about this. If you work from synchronicities, the numbers, these are the same things that I've just been pulling out and reading from my notes. Bro. Like this shit is real. Eliminate what is no longer there. Shed that old skin. Remember, you know, it's okay to remember where the humble beginnings, remember where you come from. Spend time alone meditating upon what you truly desire. Just like I said, clean up, go outside, ground yourself, like get your shit together. Take your time if you need it, you know, whatever this, this may be. Look, positive energy. And then right up under that, it was a new dawn. Look, empowerment. You're more powerful than you realize. That's another confirmation on something that I said. It's safe for you to be powerful. Use music for manifesting. So go listen to that Humble Beginnings by Bazzi, B-A-Z-Z-I. It may, that may not be how you pronounce his name, but that's how I'm pronouncing it tonight. And I'm telling you right now, baby. Listen, cut it again, and it's on empowerment. You are more powerful than you realize, and a new dawn came out anyways. The worst is now behind you. Positive new experiences are on the horizon. You guys are going to sign. To uh, sign. Okay, so somebody's signing something, but you guys are going to start finding little clues you just have to be present and paying attention because although i was pissed off that she lost her phone and we did not find it on the way back to the car i looked down and i was like no nah, i'm not gonna pick it up but i do see that acorn i did write something about it so it's like yeah i'm gonna look at it. and you know and i had my book with me because i was doing some writing while i was out there and i done a reading as well but then it was like okay 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 so so, okay, so it's this thing. So, do I take it or no? And then I was like, nah, just see that you seen the acorn. Look, you are a powerful healer. Keep up the good work. Self-employed. Like you're an entrepreneur and your business is going to thrive. Speak prosperity over your business. All of our business, if you have a business and you are on my page, if you have a business that you are giving birth to currently, I speak peace, prosperity, longevity over your business. May you or your family never lack a single fucking thing. So mote it be a shay, a shay, a shay. Thank you, spirit, for all that you are doing in our life. I am so very thankful. And I ain't even really seen, you know, I feel like that was my new. Today was real small. $110, you know, is cool because I needed it. But I also fucking spent it as soon as I got it. <laughs> but still, it went on things that I needed. You know, because I obviously needed it. And deserve it. <laughs> what I say? Spiritual growth, family content. You gonna be motherfucking straight forever. No lacking. No lacking. No bad news. No unstable. None of that. No competition. None of that. Leadership. Dependable. None of that. None of that. Detach from anybody that's a liar in your energy. We ain't got time for that. You can't motherfucking grow like that. You know. Yes, I watered the plants today. Motherfucker, my plants over here dead as fuck. You did not water my shit. That type of shit. Uh-uh. Anything with confusion and lies, gotta go. We operating through creativity. That's how your business is going to thrive. Anyways, let me get off here, honey, because... No, 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 no. Hold on. Y'all, it's just so much energy. <sighs> so much energy. Look, I told you, somebody may be actually going through, like, some shit where people are attacking them. It's transmute that shit into prosperity. I used to... You know, at first I went from, you know, return to sender. And then now I'm just like, you know what? Turn that into prosperity. Give me a penny for they thought. Give me a hundred for they thought. Give me 200 for they thought. Let me 500 for your thought, Alex. Face ass. The fuck? <laughs> Give me that. Look, group of warlocks. 
Bad company, corrupt good morals. Make sure you know who the fuck you're dealing with. Don't let nobody come try to dig up no, no dirt to try to act like they're going to start your garden. No. At all. The fuck? No. Anyway, Spirit, may I please have clarity to close out this message pertaining to this oak tree? Maybe the fruits of your labor. Oh, the fruits of your labor. I can just taste it. Do you, boo-boo. Do what makes you happy. Boomerang backfired. So if someone was telling... um. Telling you, you know, don't wait on nobody, get your life together, or don't wait on nobody to get their life together. I don't know if this is you. This is what somebody was telling your person. You know, I'm not sure, but some shit backfired here. What I told you. Guidance. Guidance. Speaking of, I seen a snake and I seen a, a owl the other day. Owls represents... Wisdom, inner knowing, knowledge, intuition, snake, shedding old skin, snakes literally being in your vicinity. This shit's boomerang. Now you're getting prosperity. Look, the karmic lesson. Are you motherfucking tired of doing this shit? Are you tired of doing spell work or are you, you not? Are you tired of doing you or you not? May I have clarity on boomerang, please? Ooh. Look, loss of power, catastrophic events, something unpleasant, bad weather. Also, it said um, the oak tree represents Zeus, the god of thunder. Same shit, hell. Look, the answer to your prayers are found in this reading. Use your own discernment. About a masculine A through F here. Rising ascended masters, human who have taken the sixth initiation. Capable of rebirth. Again, lessons to be learned. Achieving challenges. Achieved the challenges. In love and in light. Look. Green light. So somebody got the green light. Male name A through F, please. This could be your name. This could be the person that you're dealing with. Take it however. Male name A through F, please, Spirit. Male energy that needs to grow up. Good company, prosperous, equal commitment, give and take. That was the karmic lesson to be learned. This masculine had to grow up here in order to get back to this balance even. Listen, this masculine could have been an institutionalized mindset. Yeah. Somebody know that they're that they got a real one on their team. They know to keep going. This ain't no counterfeit. Look, ancestral wisdom here once again. Just to come from just to confirm that along this journey. Again, I told you people do rituals under the oak tree. So I also mentioned someone else was doing spell work. Because but listen, it's gonna boomerang on them because they are not respecting the rights of others. That is a universal law here. Anointed and tormented. Severe mental suffering. 
that could reflect back onto what I was referring to myself personally about not knowing, you know, my worth and all of that. Okay, so this is a masculine. Yeah. This is a masculine, A through F, who is a gamer, Xbox, PlayStation, you know, someone that, or that could just be overall what they're doing is playing games. But I'm getting that this is someone that is in this mentally suffering and they just sit around and just play the fucking video game all day. And they're needing to grow the fuck up and walk and talk like the God that they are. But I feel like that's something like they could be the one that's suffering from addictions. And I feel like that this is all about to be over with. So if you guys are dealing with someone that is suffering from addictions, I can feel it breaking. I can feel the chains breaking. Um, childhood issues are affecting their life right now. So that is a reason why they are stuck in this childish ass energy. Yep. Look. Hurricanes, storms, Zeus, again, Zeus, the God of thunder. So this is literally like the fruits of your labor, love. So if you have been praying for someone that has been fighting addictions. Then I feel like it's going or. No, you guys could be fighting with a male earth sign here. Or like I said, this is the male earth sign that's fighting um, addictions. I don't, I don't know. Let's see. Oh, shit. Okay. So... If you guys are beefing with a male earth sign, a near-death situation is going to wake them up. I told you a catastrophic event. Peace is going to surpass it all. Can't touch it. Like I said, fucking boomerang. Wow. Rough time with spouse. I said if somebody was having a hard time with their partner, I seen that shit. They're having a rough time with their soulmate. But you got haters on the sideline. Psh, baby, bitch. Listen, listen, I'm ending it. I'm ending it. I love y'all. Just no oh fruits of your labor, baby. Just just going to put a plate out here. This is leftover from my muffins, from my blueberry muffin. But y'all just just go ahead and just sit your plate out there. Just just sit your plate out there. Just sit your plate out. Matter of fact, yesterday, male air sign. Yes, true. You're worthy of the best. Don't settle for the bullshit. Okay, so male air sign. Because that was something different. I don't know. These could be, you know, your signs, their signs. You got to apply it wherever, honey. Um, They were sent to go against you, but instead... They fell in love with you. So this is a female water sign... A female air sign. A male. Oh my god. So is this gang stalking? Is this what we doing? The guides will lead you to victory. Victory confirmation once again. Female earth sign. Allow fear and anxiety and stress to dissolve. You're moving forward. Listen. Expect to get unexpected money soon. Don't waste it. It's a blessing. Keep it in universal flow. Be a blessing if you're able to get a blessing. You got to be a blessing to get a blessing. That is, I, that is my motto. I stand firm on that. Okay, so maybe this female. Look, I told you somebody going to be a blessing in your life. So somebody getting a blessing and somebody reaping the bag. Listen, I, I'm in there right here. I love y'all. Peace. Love, peace, and hair grease. I'm out.